for this exercise I want you to go up to your new to your open tab and in the shared drive under BCHS PLTW IED intro to engineering shared part you're gonna find a part called top holder let's say that you log on and the person from your other group has shared this part with you you are assigned to make some kind of a support to hold this up off the ground and it has to be able to fit into these two tabs be the right spacing apart the right thickness for the material and everything has to work together one way you may think of to try and do this is to go back and investigate what their original dimensions were in the extrusions a much easier way is to open this as a new assembly place the part in again this is under shared BCHS PLTW IED intro to engineering shared part so now we're in an assembly file from an assembly file we have the option to create a new part I'm going to call it support using this geometry to help create it so I just clicked on the part and I'm going to select 2D sketch and I'm going to pick if I zoom in real close this face to make a sketch on I'm going to go back to my isometric view for just one second and I'm going to choose to project geometry of both of these inside faces go back to my front view I click on the bottom line and if I hit F7 to slice my graphics it doesn't actually help but I can see here and here how big these pegs need to be I'm going to use my rectangle tool to create two sketches there. Use my rectangle tool again to draw out this box. I can make this whatever size I want now. And when I finish my sketch, I can extrude. And because I don't know the thickness, instead of choosing distance, I can choose two. Rotate this piece around and pick the other face of this slot let me try that again here so the piece that I've now created is the perfect size that will fit this other top holder piece if I want to do anything to change the geometry of it I can now go in here and make the outsides of it look all fancy okay and there you have it that's creating a custom part one thing I forgot to show you double click on it make sure you go file save as and make sure that this support is saved somewhere where you can find it again later. So pick out a file, save it into there, and you can place it like any other part.